the order. Kelly, hi, it's Art from uh, Coast Floral. Did you reject an order I gave you for $85 and you said that you don't accept orders from order gatherers? Okay, so I don't know. When Yesterday. Place Yesterday. Yesterday? Uh-huh. Who is it, who's it going to? It was, it was going to Janice Sisson, S-I-S-S-O-N, in Auburn. Okay, let me look. Sure. I just wanted to understand, that's all. Well, I think I talked to you yesterday. Uh, you were, I? you couldn't be nicer. Yeah, and I sent the order through the system and you asked for it, and I did, and then, then you re somebody rejected it. Hmm. Coast to Coast Florist. Yes, right? that's me, coast correct. Coast. Oh, yeah, she did reject it. How come? I don't know. <laughs> Can I send it back over? Okay, so do you have a storefront? I think that's why she's questioning it. I'm sorry, do I have a what? Do, do you have a storefront? I own Beneva Flowers for 35, 30 years. I'm okay, a, so you, you make them and deliver them locally to your customers? I used to for 30 years. Now I'm just doing this to take care of my customers that have ordered with us for years because I sold the business. So all I can do oh. is continue to manage my club. I'm not sure what, yeah. what relevancy that has. If you're, an, if you're an order gatherer, so if your customers give you orders, but you don't, if you don't have a storefront, we don't deliver. We only do it with other flower shops. I'm sorry. What, what, I don't know whether, what, what is the difference? Because, because we have um, been doing it. We quit doing it with From You Flowers, um, all those internet companies that, that give us orders and then. It, it's not worth it to us to do it. It's, it turns into a hassle, and we would rather serve our customers. I'm, I'm just not understanding when you say do it. What is it that you're doing? We, we're filling your orders for you. Okay. Yeah. I sold it to a customer, beautiful image of the Dazzler, which is a Telefor item. I sent it through the Telefor network, and you're saying yeah. that you won't fill the order because I don't have a storefront? It's a, it, because you're a third-party order gatherer. I, I don't know what difference does that make if I have a storefront or not. It, 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 it matters to us. We're the ones that care. So I get, I don't know what else I can say about Well, but if I'm going to give this to another shop, it doesn't matter to you that you're just walking away from honest. But maybe this is what it is. Is it the, the deceptive gathering you don't like? Or do you just feel like I shouldn't take an order? Yeah. And no, I'm not... you can do whatever. You, you do what you do. Oh, and, thank and you. This is, this is the rule. This is what our owner has come up with and that's what he so we're just following so you know, we're just doing what our what our what our owner wants us to do and that and we've been doing it for a couple of years I now. just don't understand because I've had a store for 30 years and I've sent out many wire orders and now that mm -hmm. my company gets an order honestly and we don't you know we don't act like we're in your town we're not deceptive we're not cutting the order we're not misrepresenting the order I'm just wondering understanding I'm your position I'm, I, I we're just not going to take the order but you don't have to. I mean, you're not doing me. I mean, you're not hurting me by not to. I don't understand the intention when our industry needs shops to fill our orders to work together. Yes, flat, actual flower shops need other flower shops to fill their orders. Who who created that idea? I'm sorry. I, I don't want to argue with. We're not arguing. Don't, we're not arguing. I, argue I just wanted to understand. I just wanted to understand what sense that made. If and, and if you don't mind, I'm going to record this and replay it because I can hardly believe it. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, like I said, we're not going to fill the order. Okay, so you understand that, right? I understand why. Okay, then I'm going to record this and replay it because I just can't understand this conversation. Uh, I don't even know what to say. Well, you're representing I, it properly. Ma'am, you're, you're representing what your boss wants you to do properly. I just think it's insane. If you would like to call him back. What's his name? What's his name? His name is Anders. Anders. Oh, is the, what's his number? You can reach him here. He's here for about one hour every morning. He works one hour every day, and this guy's telling us how to conduct business. Okay. Listen, you're being really <laughs> defensive and confrontational. 
<laughs> no, no. I mean, just I know that you're realizing this doesn't make any sense either. Okay. Several flower shops. Wow. Where you can catch them at. It sounds like he's a pretty smart guy. In the morning. All right. Well, thank you very much. I really appreciate the way you handled it as well. All right. Have Bye. a great day. All right. So you heard that for yourself. Yes.